Greetings, adventurers, and welcome to the Adventure Incorporated Podcast. I am your dungeon master, Anthony Reed. I'm, I'm Anthony Reed. <clears throat> this is episode 184. It is the third episode of The Path of Enchantment. How are you, how are you doing? Like you, are you, you doing well? I'm, I'm just checking in. I'm just, make, just making sure you're doing well. Just feeling... Uh, feeling that you're good you know this episode is brought to you by our patrons at patreon.com slash adventuring that is patrons like adam who by the way adam uh by the way one of our patrons adam created the character of jacques who you see in these episodes he's written some short stories if you haven't checked those out you absolutely should they're on our website uh they're amazing work they are canon and now this character exists on the show so that proves it uh but yes uh adam chris graden mary phil without our patrons we would uh, be sad. There's so much that we've been able to do with the show uh, that we couldn't do without the patrons. We thank each and every one of them so much. And if you aren't a patron and you want to support the show, you want to see it continue to grow, head over to patreon.com slash adventuring. Become a patron today. There's cool stuff there. Uh, plus, you support us and make the show better and, and last longer and uh, be cooler. All right, let's get started. Nobles and farmers, knights and wenches, gather round, gather round to hear a tale of excitement and mystery. Brave adventurers facing grave dangers. Keth, the fighter monk. Like usually when you bring people back from the dead in books, it turns out really bad. That's just to sell more books. (laughs) (laughs) Jibedo, the rogue. God, it's so good Uh, to see something positive happen. Um... (laughs) God, I'm so glad to be back home. You know, let's make sure we get Clug fixed up, then we'll have two under our belts. This is awesome. Genevera, the sorcerer. Genevera, you are a powerful sorcerer capable of uh, very strong magics. Oh, this is the first time someone acknowledges how good I am at magic. (laughs) Convict me of a fucking crime? What the shit? (laughs) Gillick, the paladin warlock. Can we find you, like, something else to tap into instead? Yeah. What, give up four levels of warlock? Are you shitting me? <laughs> <laughs> and Asher, the druid barbarian. Uh, Asher, like, puts his hand on Jibeto's shoulder. This is the most affectionate you've ever seen, Asher. <laughs> <laughs> Let us recall what happened before. Yeah, let's, let's talk. What do, you, what do you need? We heard you need something. Yes, yes. Uh, I am looking for something for my uh, ship captain who is uh, willing to provide service for you if you are willing to uh, help us find a little something here on uh, land side, yes? Well, you're going to give us a little bit more details than that. Prepare yourselves, for this is the tale of Adventure Incorporated. Uh, let's get started. Okay. Uh, so, uh, I think we're probably going to pick up a few hours after the coronation. The coronation is at dawn, so we will pick up, uh, a few hours later. At dawn? Okay. Yeah. If People you reco- wake up at dawn for this? If you were, rec- the for coronations? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They're yeah. a big deal. Yep. They are yeah. a big deal. Okay, so... Can we just go over the logistics? Yeah. Of Can you how imagine the night before we decided we were going to have a coronation, and then at dawn there was a big enough crowd? Yes. Uh, ten people ran through the streets uh, of Verena shouting loudly about a coronation at dawn. And medieval life is so boring that people are like, what the fuck are they yelling about? And they were like, oh, coronation. Yeah. We could go. We'll get up. We'll go to the coronation. I would have to, like, submit a time off request. I would have to wait for my manager to approve it. Yeah, I mean, they don't really, uh, they don't really have weeks. those formalized systems of oppression, you know? It's just it sort of a be... general oppression. Yeah, it's just it a be... general. <laughs> it would be weeks before I could go to the coronation. Let's yeah. set up my next album, General Oppression. 
general oppression. Yep. <laughs> That's the next person we're going to meet tonight. Right. <laughs> so the uh, head Dan of the... Hutt, it's yeah, general the, oppression. The five of you are uh, in the palace, and the, the head of the guard, general oppression, makes his way... <laughs> <laughs> It's Perfect. better than not naming the guards. Uh, yeah. and it's, it's better it's a than actually better naming name the than guards. Heaven. Yeah. <laughs> right? Uh, no, that, he doesn't. He's but, not there. It's fine. Uh, my favorite, my favorite thing is that you're like, oh, I can't name him Kevin. Uh, Heaven. Like that's what happened. Like, <laughs> right. Replace a letter. Done. <laughs> uh, it's way worse than that. I was like, too many H names. I'll go with Kevin. <laughs> I was like, oh no, Kevin's a stupid name. And so Fall I back quickly on you, well, you know an H name. <laughs> It's a good thing that word isn't used for anything. <laughs> <laughs> I quickly scrambled. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing left in my brain was like, I got this H for you. You, <laughs> you want to use this? <laughs> well, well, well. Look who's coming back for the H. Saved it, brain. Good, good one. Improv. <laughs> it starts with an H. Improv. Improv. <laughs> Right. Uh, this, uh, <laughs> look, his fucking character died weeks ago. <laughs> Can we move oh, did on? he die? I forgot about him. Oh, we killed him. Oh, we right. killed, we him. killed heaven. Oh God. <laughs> oh, God. Did we kill hell? Yes. Hell, yeah. <laughs> All right. But we, uh, we do. We did though. <laughs> you did. There remember, was. Enough, I don't know you... if you remember this plot point, but Asher died. <laughs> oh right! Yeah, but we, I didn't bring this up. Yeah, I know that. Up in a while, y'all keep bringing it up because you're like, "Wow, I, he hasn't done it in a while." I'm gonna bring it up and then tease it like he brought it up. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Rob, we get it. You fucking. Died. I'm not talking about it. Jesus. <laughs> I've moved on. Everyone else, move on. <laughs> <laughs> I like you. <laughs> All right, great. We're going to move on. So uh, what are the five of you doing post-coronation? Just happy to be alive, man. Go to the boat. Let's go deliver this book to the boat and then get on the boat. We, should, we don't yeah. even get to feast. Isn't there a feast usually with a coronation? Yeah, I want some food. That was oh, I'm not a high-maintenance king. <laughs> a breakfast? Yeah, a it was a brunch? breakfast. <laughs> a brunch. <laughs> A coronation brunch. Yeah. A coronation uh, continental breakfast. A Gen- royal Genevera's brunch a little tipsy with... on mimosas. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I like that Genevera says she's not a high maintenance king, but only she owns an 800,000 gold uh, uh, carriage in the backyard. You know what I mean? It wasn't that much. 80,000. It was, uh, yeah. And I didn't pay for it. The right. kingdom did. That's right. It came out of the taxes of these Gibetto working people. It's coming out of Gibetto's Adventure Incorporated salary. She had a chat with Clyde about it. Clyde um, has no bearing on my salary. Yeah, but he knows the books. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he's a little preoccupied with other books nowadays, but... Uh, he's he's allowed nowhere near the books. We had to We had to set up that separation between... Yeah, well, she talked to Clyde about it anyway. Let's see that conversation. <laughs> Did you just direct her that into? <laughs> hey, Clyde. Uh, There's Clyde now. So I was like, um, that was a great uh, cor- uh, like coronation or whatever. Thanks. It was, God. it was good. It was a yeah. nice coronation. Yeah, it was. It was fun, isn't it? Crazy. We're both like kings now. That is like. That is, uh, that's wild, you know? Yeah. Who'd have thought, like, when we, uh, when we met and I was, like, casting Detect Magic in your room or whatever? Yeah. That, uh, that you this remember. is where we'd be. That's crazy. That's crazy that you remember that. Um, yeah, I mean, it wasn't, I mean, I wouldn't say it was, like, my f- favorite thing ever, you know? Because, like. Uh, oh, Gibetto was kind of a dick about it. They're um, all, yeah, because they're all, because they're all kind of dicks. Yeah, that's like a, yeah. That's a, that's a what? I mean, that's just a thing. I don't know. I don't like. I don't really know why. Uh, I don't know why they're such dicks. You know. I think they just feel threatened by, you know, because they were trying to prove themselves, and I don't know. And you were, it's like, you know. 
Yeah, I guess. Um. Uh. Anyway. Uh. Congratulations. And um. You know now, like w- when we do like Council of King stuff or whatever, I'll see you there. Yeah. Okay. Cool. It's a. It's a thing. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you a didn't talk. Back. You didn't talk to him at all about the books. <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> You're just telling Gibetto you did. Right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> cool scene. <Great> scene. <laughs> it's definitely going in there. It really flushed out our yeah. world. Yeah, that definitely won't get cut. <laughs> no, it definitely fucking won't because Anthony doesn't cut anything. Yeah, no, he doesn't. It won't, it's like it won't fucking hilarious cut. if this is the one thing that he's like, you know what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He doesn't even cut the thing that says, yeah, this is going to get cut, which feels like the natural thing to cut. (laughs) I mean, I do cut some stuff, but that should just tell you how egregious it has to be. (laughs) Uh, Okay. So, uh, anyone else want to do anything before you head to the docks? I think we should all get scenes where... Nothing happens. All right, who yeah. do you want to have a nothing hey, happens scene with? Make your own scenes. Yep, that's it. This is what we're doing. We're doing <laughs> make your, your own, own scenes here. It's like it's like when you cook a pizza at home. Give me uh, give me that's your mediocre scene that's you made right. yourself. Nope, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, co- I'm gonna cook a pizza. Um, so Asher goes to the kitchen. Uh, I assume Gillick's there, but I don't know. Um, yeah, he is. he's he's writing in his journal. He thinks he's alone. He doesn't like, he doesn't hear you come in. Hey hey Gillick. What what what? what? Before we go what? on the boat, do you want to cook a pizza? Yes. Cool. Oh, God, yes. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, make a pizza. Let's make a pizza. <laughs> um, uh, we need dough. Do you know how to make dough? Or is there some already prepared in here? Hey, look, there's dough right here. <laughs> oh, look at this dough. <laughs> oh, what a convenience. Hey, <laughs> Slab. It's, Slab. it's a lot of dough. Uh, <laughs> too much a- dough. <laughs> Asher, Gillick, I got I got all this pepperoni I was going to eat. What are you guys up to? Dude, come you on in. <laughs> We're going to make a pizza. Oh, oh no way. perfect. You, uh, we could use my pepperoni. Look at yeah. all the dough we have. <laughs> Great. Gibetto, what are you doing for your scene that doesn't mean that, that nothing happens in? Uh, yeah, so I just would really like six gallons of tomato sauce. <laughs> uh, you can go ahead and charge Six the charge gallons. the castle for it. Um, they're good for it. Of of course, sir. Of course, I have uh, many different varieties of tomato from the garden. Is there uh, any in particular you're looking for? Uh, just the most in a can uh, that I can take back right now. <laughs> do, they, do they have canning? Six no. Cans of tomato sauce. <laughs> in a in a can, you say, sir? Yeah, uh, you know, just for ease of transport. Um, oh, I'll get, I'll get right on that. Thanks. <laughs> While you That's wait, whole I feel like this is missing <laughs> something, and we, I'm just looking at this like perfectly <laughs> circular piece of dough with just pepperonis on it. <laughs> it's like this is definitely missing something. Wouldn't you agree, guys? Like, I feel like this yeah, is right. Yeah, I don't what know. Are the ingredients of a pizza again. I'd um, eat that. Okay, great. Uh, Gibetto, <laughs> uh, when you return to the castle with your sauce, before you make your way to the uh, kitchens, uh, you run into Elatrix. Um, he's preparing himself to get ready to leave. Um, he says, Ah, d- uh, Gibetto, I didn't uh, expect to see you before I headed off, but I wanted to uh, I wanted to make sure I had a chance to talk with you. I figured it would just be down the line. Yeah. Well, what's up? I I wanted to make sure that you are okay. Um Yeah, honestly, I'm I'm pretty good. Uh I'm I got to say uh you know, I'm a little disappointed with the uh the tomato sauce vendors uh closest to the castle, but um you know, this barrel's going to work out fine. I just really wish it had been in a can. Uh huh. Um, I was referring more to the, um, uh, let's say, incidents that have occurred of late. You and the, I know that the Cardozas had inflicted a lot of pain on you. Yeah. And um, surprisingly, I'm feeling a lot better now. 
Um, <laughs> I I was carrying around a lot of stuff, and I didn't really realize it. Um, but like, I'm feeling pretty good. Um, you know, I I think uh, I think having having a purpose fulfilled was a really um, like the closer I got to it, the more consumed by it I was. You know what I mean? And like, uh, I kind of let it be like a replacement goal for like dealing with a lot of stuff. Um, but like being back in Verena and not being chased around and not fearing for like my continued survival was was really good for putting a lot of stuff behind me. Um, thanks though. That's like really, really nice of you to reach out. Kibito, you are an interesting creature. What do you mean? You may be in the many, many long years I have spent in Numerita. You may be the only person I've ever met who's gotten actual catharsis out of revenge they sought. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I think I might have, uh, I might be, like, replacing, um, you know, other feelings, uh, with the, with the feeling of satisfaction that I've gotten from doing this, uh, but, like, I really love it in Verena, and it's really, really, really good to be able to be here and not be scared. Hmm. Like, I don't want to say, like, Sale will always be home, right? But, like, I spent almost as much time in these streets as I did there. And, like, the major theme of everyone I knew here was that fear. And being able to, like, release people from that feels really fucking good. Again, I am, I truly am glad for you that you have found peace in this. I do not think it is common, but I am, I was worried, and I am happy to see that the, those fears were misplaced. Yeah, now I, now I'm nervous that I'm wrong. That you're um, you can only feel how you feel. You can't be right or wrong about that. I, look, I worried because I have seen people consumed by uh, revenge. That people who think that is what they want and then they get it and it does not help fill that hole. But if what you wanted was peace from them, then you have achieved that. And that that is far nobler than... Uh, wanting to exact revenge. And if that was not truly your goal, but instead this other thing, that is good. You have, you have earned your solace. Huh. Yeah, I wonder... Well, thanks. Um, I really thought this was just going to be a run for tomato sauce. Uh, I'm sorry, I wasn't, um, I guess I wasn't prepared for this, but, um... Well, uh, then I am sorry. As I said, I did no. not expect to run into you on my way out of town, but I wanted to make sure I took a moment to try and... I appreciate, uh, that, because, um, you're the only other person I know with a goal fulfilled, uh, and, like... Seeing the way that you handled that uh, versus the way that I'm feeling, uh, I was feeling weird. Like, I felt like I guess I was supposed to be more, I don't know, unfulfilled. Because, like, it seems like that's the case for you. It seems like you, you did what you were supposed to do and it didn't make you happy. I, there are big differences between you and me. 
I am... I am fundamentally bound by my purpose. It is a part of my being in a way that it is not for you. You can have a much more complex relationship with uh, your intention. You can have... Uh, you can feel good about it today and you can feel bad about it tomorrow and you can feel good about it the next day. That is within your being. It is part of what makes you of the greater races. It is that uh, ephemeralness, that depth that my kind lacks. You are most similar to my kind. You are from us. You are of our people. But even that, you do not carry the same burden we do. The one of purpose. My purpose was fulfilled and it it has fundamentally changed me because I no longer have what I have become is something both lesser but related to what I was. I do not think you have become lesser because your purpose is fulfilled. No, I don't think so either. That is what makes you different from you, as in you and all of your companions and all of the people of this realm. It's what makes you different from those of us who are of the Fae or of the Celestial Court or of Shadow. That's a lot to think about. Um, the idea that like, once you've done what you're supposed to do, your lesser hmm. well I'm glad you're still around even if you know you're not really yourself anymore or you're you know feeling different or whatever um, for us ephemeral people you're still you're still real important man I appreciate that I have chosen to be here for now. Well, um, I, I gotta go put this somewhere. Um, so like, I'll see you around, okay? Okay. Good luck, Gibetto. Thank you. He leaves. Uh, Gibetto <coughs> continues on into, um, into the like hallway outside of Clyde's quarters um, and just kind of uh, leaves the full barrel of tomato sauce in front of Clyde's door. <laughs> okay. And then goes back to his quarters. Okay. <laughs> It, like tipped. Yeah, so did you not like it? take out the bung so it's no, like slowly no, it's just, leaking? It's just sitting there. <laughs> it's just real weird. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Meanwhile, as you pass the kitchen, like a, a, a tongue of flame just like shoots out because we burnt <laughs> the pizza. <laughs> the bread? <laughs> yeah, you've burned your pepperoni <laughs> bread? <laughs> yeah, I, I really figured we were missing a lot of stuff, but you know. Do we have, do we nah. have any cheese? Jeez. This, guy, this is gonna taste. <laughs> this is gonna. This is gonna taste so good. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what the fuck, Anthony? What? A bunch of nothing scenes, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, I assumed there was gonna be a turning point that Elatrix would just say something real dumb, and be like, oh, I'm kind of hungry. Let's go get some food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is why we can't have what we want. Well, wow. <laughs> after after all of yeah. that pizza Fun. making, I've, I feel like I've done some personal introspection that, like, <laughs> like about right. the nature you, of purpose. You know what right. I mean? You've yeah. had some growth. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I think this needed sauce, too. But. Yeah, I think it needed sauce. Uh, <laughs> uh, from, from down the hallway, you guys just hear, like, banging and yelling, like, 
Help! Help! <laughs> Someone's yelling for help! Quickly, let's go! Let's go! Help. Oh, the door, the door, the door opens door out. Opens. <laughs> <laughs> you run into the hallway and you see uh, Clyde's bedroom door. Like he's trying to open it and it's banging against what looks like a barrel uh, uh, in the center of the hallway. I I move it. Yeah, we Keth go laughs. over and it's, move the it's, barrel. It's heavy, uh, but you Do move it on the way. a strength check? Okay. No, no, yeah. the two I'm of you together helping. are fine. Uh, yeah. You move this barrel of... Uh, uh, the two of them together, but Jabeto carried it in himself? I, I imagine... I mean, it, was it. On a, it was on a <laughs> cart, like oh. a little... Yeah. You know. Sure. Yeah. And I imagine Jabeto struggled truck, with it. if you will. <laughs> uh, Cl- Clyde yeah. comes out, he's like, Oh, what... What the hell? Hi, are you okay? Yeah, somebody trying to trap me in there. I, I was afraid I was gonna get assassinated or whatever. Uh, no, well, it's Looks just like a... somebody locked you in with assassinated Sauce. or whatever. <laughs> assassinated. <laughs> we cut to the boat. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's it. We're done. We did it. We've, Nothing else. We peaked there. Mad <laughs> So the five of you head into the town. Uh, we're saying probably uh, uh, early afternoon. Uh, you make your way into town. Um, you got a pizza joint in this town? <laughs> oh, hell yeah, dude. There's so much pizza in this town. You really? know, they say Verena is like famous for how good its pizza is. Really? Yeah, there's like- there's some places that say that uh, only pizza from Verena is pizza and everything else yeah, is just yeah, flatbread. Yeah. Everything else is flatbread with sauce. Dude, let me take you to a place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. What, what place do you recommend? Uh, Gibetto takes him to uh, the original pizza place. That's its name. <laughs> but there's one oh. across the street that's owned by different people. That's also and called it, the and original and that pizza one's place. called the first pizza place. <laughs> yeah, <you're right. laughs> there we go. I, so I'm an original pizza guy. I okay. know some people are first pizza guys. They're wrong. Uh, uh, trust me. <laughs> They, you can tell the difference. Uh, I feel like I'm going to have to do a taste test. Yeah, you can't actually tell the difference. They're the same fucking pizza. <laughs> oh, really? No, like that. That's, you know, like that's, a, that's on the side. That's not. Right, Gibetto, right. Gibetto will tell oh, okay. you original pizza, but on the side, yeah, yeah, yeah. they're the same pizza. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah, they Gibetto, really, like, uh, they have uh, one common kitchen underground. Uh, <laughs> awesome. Pizza just goes up and around. <laughs> Great. <laughs> oh, it's a manufactured rivalry? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> awesome. Neat. Perfect. Cool. Great. <laughs> do how, they have any pizza that you have to eat with a spoon? Because that's, that's how I like to eat my pizza. <laughs> I, I like that the city that was formerly run by crime bosses has a scam pizza place. Formerly. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> formerly. <laughs> well, I mean, we killed all of them. Well, some of them. But now we, I mean, technically that sounds like we are. <laughs> we are crime bosses now. Murderers. Look yeah. at me. Look at me. I am the crime boss now. <laughs> I am crime boss. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, but seriously, like, first pizza's trash. O- okay. Original pizza, that's where it's at. Uh, I also we can, get some we original can try pizza. both. Uh, yeah. But I just want you to be prepared. Uh, I'm not going to spend a single gold at first pizza. Right, okay. That's fine. I will. I want, I want to try it. It's probably smart because you've got a fancy carriage to pay for. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, I don't I don't I'm sorry, Genevera. I don't actually live here anymore. <laughs> That's not for me to pay for. <laughs> oh, I guess I see indirectly by supporting the pizza company who's going to pay taxes. I guess uh, you you know what, you're right. All right. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> and Gibetto heads into original pizza. Okay. <laughs> Gillick follows. Yeah, you, here's my carriage contribution. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you guys get a um, get a couple of slices for lunch, uh, yep. and as you I feel co- like this pizza could carry me home. <laughs> as you uh, exit Original Pizza uh, across the street uh, at First Pizza, you see um, someone that Gillick Asher Gibetta, uh, G- Gillick Asher and Keth recognize uh, as Jacques Sly Song. Uh, everyone, make uh. me a perception check. Uh, 26. Did you say 6, Eight. Genevera? I did. Nice. 23. 17. I did 20 better. 26. What did you have, Gillick? 17. And Keth? 8. Okay. Uh, Asher, uh, as you... 
look at him sort of out of the corner of your eye uh, when you you see something that doesn't look quite right and you refocus on him and then he looks normal. But for a second, you just get this uh, almost a, an image of, of something off with him. Image of something off with him? Yeah, you don't know what it is, but there was something that was not like not right in your mind. Uh, it, like, you know, it, it sent up a flare of uh, adrenaline, and then you looked, and he was fine. But mm -hmm. uh, there's um, something not quite right about him. I'd like to do an Arcana check to see if there is an, an illusion spell nearby, or actually, I could probably just cast Detect Magic. <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah. Clatter on. We need. Yeah. No. Cast I. I. I ca well, now I have it prepped because of that. Uh, I cast the tech magic. Yeah, he seems to shimmer with um, with a natural magic. A natural magic. Mm-hmm. Do I understand what that like? He is. He, hmm. It, I don't understand. Um, Arcana check to understand. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> it is specifically magic you don't understand. Okay. <clears throat> Does but Gibetto he seems, see he himself seems, no. He himself Damn. seems like um, um, to be magic. Is what you're saying. Yeah, there is something magic about him. Okay. Um, it's made of magic. Hey, hey uh, Gibetto, that's yeah. the guy with, the, we're going to give the boot, book, but like, hold on a second. Oh, there's this something is the book guy. No, yeah, but shh, there's something weird about him. I like he he I think there's yeah, like an sure. illusion or something. No, I'm I swear there's like an illusiony <laughs> thing going on with him right now. And Ever I don't know what it is. Since you met him, you haven't super trusted this guy. No, tr you got to listen to me. Oh, you I'm, are I'm, the uh, mini pennies, no? <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, how you been? Jibetto oh, I have been well. Okay. Stumble knuckle timber shivers at your service. And he deep bows. Oh. Pizza in one hand, hat in the other. Put he, the hat back on. Uh, Puts the Jacques, pizza on his head by accident. <laughs> <laughs> Jacques bows back deeply. He says, it is a pleasure to meet you. Oh, it's a, thanks. And wow. Keth, I have been thinking about you. Yeah, yeah. No, it's great to see you. I was thinking about your uh, your proposal, and I, uh, I think we're all in agreement that we would like to take you up on it. Ah, I am very happy that you would like to take me up on my proposal. That makes me, uh, <laughs> oh, I, I, I am surprised it has come so soon, but, uh, I will take, uh, I will take it, Keth. Yes, I will yeah, happily. Let's, let's do it. Let's go. What, what a big day. Wait, Keth, did you get proposed to? Yeah. Genevera becomes king. <clears throat> Keth is getting married. What? Mary? I love this. Yeah, no, this guy's... What? They're, no, uh, oh, we, we, have, I, we have your book. I, I don't know what these goofballs are talking the, about. The but. heat oh, sorry. between them is ridiculous. Right. I mean, I saw the way you looked at each other. I felt it. Like, you said proposal. Yeah, I trust him. You said yes. He, he responded so excited. I am still excited if that is a thing that you would like. But I Did also I would... Uh, this? I would also like to be introduced to this lovely vision over here. And he looks at Genevera. Oh, okay. Genevera like, who's he pointing at? <laughs> yeah, we all look around. Genevera's like, what vision? It you is uh, Gillick. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I appreciate the compliment. Yeah. I am, uh, you know, Gillick, you are also a very, uh, you're a handsome dwarf. I am. Uh, ah, thanks. Uh, yes, it is, uh, it is good ah, to see all of you again for the most part. <clears throat> For the most part. <laughs> Wait. Got him. Got him. <laughs> but uh, you, uh, you must be um, uh, Genuvera. <gasps> That's me. Yeah. Uh, he uh, bows and uh, he bows very deeply and holds his hand toward you. Jacques, I have a question for you. When did we tell you their names? Shh, 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 shh. When did we he tell you their names? Forward. Yeah. Shh, shh, shh. We... We probably mentioned her I'm at some point. Positive, we did. <clears throat> you are uh, the five of you are more famous than you might expect. I think uh, your exploits have been uh, traveling about, and I have, uh, after having the opportunity to meet you, I have been given the opportunity to look into your stories a little bit, and they are um, in a, how you say interesting, no? 
Oh. Go on. You are, any... uh, have become adventurers of some renown. The many pennies are known uh, all over Numerita. Cool. <laughs> Great. This is our That's... first time meeting a fan. Uh, yeah. Yeah, Ash sorry. Asher still uh, doesn't never... care. <laughs> like... Plus, um, I believe you are an acquaintance with my uh, my uncle, no? Who's who's your uncle? Uh, Evan. <gasps> Evan's Evan! your uncle. That makes so much yeah. sense. I, oh. An uncle of yeah. a sort. Uh, I can see it now. Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean of a sort? Yeah, what do you mean of a sort? What's Evan's Not last name? Morcon. Uh, yeah, I guess that would make sense. Not to buy blood. Right? Yeah, I figured. Oh. Uh, uh, what? He but is. Like he grew up with him or something? Yes, yes. He is, uh. He has been, uh. Someone who has been, uh. Supportive of me, but, uh. Not, not an uncle by blood. <coughs> Alright, yeah. That makes sense. You carry yourself, uh. In a. In a similar way. I'll say that. Uh, that is, um. Uh, that is a compliment to me. Yeah, I meant it as a compliment. I think Evan's so cool. Uh, you said hey, you had... Wh- wait, what are you doing at First Pizza? Oh, this is the original pizza place in all of Numerita. It is no, the, no, no, the no, finest no. pizza. Original is across the street. You mu- Oh, you must have come a different way from where you normally go because... No, you, no, no, you, like, no, no, no. A, you took a no, turn no, 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 the no, no. wrong way. No, no. You, you ended the first, up the first. First pizza is the first pizza ever made. Original pizza copied the first pizza. That's how it works. You know the saying, first is worst. This is where it comes from. Mm, so you're just settling for, I guess, second pizza? The original pizza. It's the best pizza. Yes, well, uh, I believe the first pizza is the best pizza. Uh, that's why I go there. Yeah, Gibetto, I think that's how math works. I don't know. Like, first. Yeah, like, <coughs> you tell me. Go get a slice of. Go get a slice of first. Oh, you don't have to tell me that twice. Gil- Gilek, Gilek, I'm coming with pizza. you. I come with yeah. Gilek. <laughs> <laughs> Gilek, 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 Gilek. Yeah, what's up? Yeah, what's up? I think he's a shape changer. I, he's Wait, either an illusion or that? he's a shape changer. I cast a tech magic, and there's like a natural energy around him, and I can't figure oh. out if he's either an illusion or if he's a shape changer. All right, and I th- all right. are you getting pizza? <laughs> <laughs> back me up here, man. Something's not right. No, I'll, I'll, I'll back you up, but I mean, I'll, I'll, I mean, I can cast a tech magic too and see if I can see what you see. Well, but uh, I, I'm gonna get some pizza first. <laughs> okay, Gilding's got priorities. <laughs> Uh, I love that he's a, holding pizza. And smells, he's like, I need to get some pizza. <laughs> there's a, smells require calories. There's a line of like 20 people in this uh, oh, at first pizza. A. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, while he's at the line, Gilik will poke his head out the door and cast a tech magic and look at Jock. Yeah, you also see this shimmer of uh, magic over him. It doesn't particularly resonate with any of the schools but it, it it is of a natural uh it is a natural magical energy okay and we'll both of you can make uh amber. both of you can make perception checks again okay amber's definitely hey. the color of jacques energy. this time at advantage oh right. sick i'll just re-roll it um cool perception 20 28 right okay no right. so no eight, 18 plus 8 is 26 26 sorry <laughs> again uh you notice uh asher this time when you look at him you notice that he has uh cat-like features um that you haven't noticed before uh his face uh It's while still humanoid and like standing up, he almost uh, he seems to have like whiskers and uh, large eyes uh, that just now that you see it, you it's it's made the connection in your mind. You don't understand how you missed it before. Look at the look at him. He's a cat person. 
I'm, I'm looking at he's. I, I don't see no, no like I look, look, see the little whiskers. See the whiskers. Like they're very. As soon as fine. it's pointed out to you, Gillick, your brain yeah. connects with that as well, yeah. and now I'm you just, see I'm it. Sorry. Oh my god! And his eyes, Catman. Like it, I'm sure. Cat well, man. <laughs> yeah, he's a cat person. He's a little. Do you have any string? Do you have any string? Oh, um. <laughs> I, yeah, hang on. Uh, uh, Gillick pulls out some string because he has some. I'm glad you have some string. <laughs> How convenient. If not, right. I was just going to use pull, rope. Gillick pulls out a ball of string. <laughs> a ball you. of yarn. <laughs> right. Uh, I, I like shadow yarn. So are you right. waiting? Are you going to wait in the line? Or are you going to? I'm. Uh, uh, does a bear shit in the woods? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I'll be back. Here, take this. I put it like behind my back. Uh, no, just just throw it out. See if he reacts. To <laughs> no. <it. laughs> Okay, <laughs> I just <laughs> throw a ball of yarn at at Jacques. Okay. Do I make a uh, rage attack? Yeah, make a dexterity ch- attack. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Nat 20, bitch. <laughs> okay. Uh, you throw the ball of yarn, and it bounces off Jacques' head. Uh, so he's like, basically he's like, um, no, I Make I've a high heard, check. <laughs> I've heard many stories of... Uh, of Genevera the brass witch uh, and of uh, of Keth the fashionably dressed uh, uh, not so many stories about the shadow of Adventure Incorporated but whoop, uh, the yarn hits him in the side of the head He's, I didn't do it, I swear to god he slowly turns back with his eyes narrowed I'm, I'm doing the thing where I'm like I'm waiting in line, I'm just looking <laughs> <to a> spider. <laughs> um, he looks at you glares and looks down at the ball of yarn and then turns back to Gibetto and says <laughs> you have done well to cover your tracks no? Gilligan didn't work oh yeah. <clears throat> that's okay get the pizza um, out of your mouth <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 this is this is like trail rations. <laughs> I, I eat. I eat while I wait to eat. <laughs> There's now like more people behind us, and the line has been moving. And I'm like, I, uh, right. I guess I'm in this now. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's line committed. <laughs> uh, is there any type of knowledge skill that would let us know about cat people? Cat people, the perception, cat nature, people. Uh, <laughs> walk like cat, talk like people. Both of you spend your time in this line extensively thinking about all of the nature and history knowledge you have regarding anything close to cat people and come up with nothing. There was no cat people in like uh, the tribes at all? Correct. Oh, interesting. Huh. Yeah, I got nothing on cat people. You've met bird people, dragon people, lizard people, never any cat people. Gibetto's a dog person. <laughs> Asher is a dog person. <laughs> you know what I mean? Kath's a cat person. <laughs> so oh, they've met one. Yeah, you're like, <laughs> you're the guy at the party that the cat likes more than their owner for some reason. Yeah. Well, so far, that would be true. (laughs) (laughs) Asher, do you have any, like, I don't know, spells that can maybe, I don't know, reveal stuff? I I can moon a beam, but I don't want to kill the guy. (laughs) Um, Moon beam, he he takes at disadvantage, and he he will unwild shape. Or or unshape, if he's a shape changer, like... (laughs) Disguise magic or whatever. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to attack the guy. Whenever I'm with you, I feel like my voice goes down an octave just because your voice is down an octave. Anyways. Thanks. Uh, um, so I also could dispel magic, but I don't know what like how strong the spell is, so it might not work. Yeah. Yeah, I remember when I tried Dawn of Truth, that didn't work. Yeah, he's... Well... I mean, I could cast it at a very high level. It just seems like... A waste. Right, but here's the thing. We're, we would be... Okay, so if we were to do that, we would be setting off the offensive for this guy, who is, seems like he's trying to help us and just get this journal, which everybody else seems okay with. Maybe we don't want to go and make enemies of this guy, and we just go along with it for now, and we can fill everybody else on the information we should as we fill go. them in, like, message and stuff. Like, we should get that. We should make yeah, sure that people... Well, Gebetto does. And... Yeah. 
Um, we just got to make sure everyone's on their guard. Because maybe he's a shape changer because it's weird for cat people to exist in the city. That's true. But I'm, I'm just going to say this. You're a shape changer and you're not evil. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'm just gonna give you a compliment real quick. <laughs> You're not evil. Uh, that's like, uh, Keth, that's when a, we are um, <laughs> on board the ship, we will uh, have time to get to know one another a little better, no? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, when's the last time you visited Evan? You should, you should come by uh, Adventure Incorporated. And Keth, yeah. are you inviting me back to your place? <laughs> well, I mean, it's it's. I share the place with with all them. I'm one, you know, one of the they can come to one of the owners. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I hope so. I mean, you gotta you know visit home every so often to make sure things are running well, huh? Yes, uh, especially Genevera. If she wants to come, I would uh, find that uh, enjoyable. Yes. Yeah, no, she she's also there. Like we're all owners. I don't I don't know if I said that, but yeah, whatever. I wish um, this weren't a podcast. I wish this were. A visual medium. <laughs> <laughs> so many of our faces right now are. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> let's just say, Genevera doesn't know what to say, but her face is full of expression. <laughs> what kind of expression? <laughs> the, the one currently on my face. <laughs> <laughs> for the listeners at home? For the listeners at home. It's so no, I mean describe it for the <laughs> listeners at home. No, nope, they're just going to have to guess. <laughs> Send in your best fan art to see what Genevieve's face really looked like. <laughs> You've given them no context whatsoever. <laughs> They'll figure it out. They're smart. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, <laughs> uh, Gillick, you make your way to the front of the line. Uh, oh, my God, finally. <laughs> <laughs> Dying over here. <laughs> Still <laughs> holding a slice from the other store. Um, excuse me, is that original pizza? I I thought this was original yeah. pizza. No, this is first pizza. And if you have a slice of original pizza, we will take that slice from you, and we will give you two slices. No, that's that's first pizza. Wait, you mean I can't finish this one? Correct. We'll give you two slices of the better pizza. Am I taking crazy pills? I thought this was right. first pizza. No, this is first, first pizza. This. No, this is first pizza. That's original pizza. No, that's original pizza. This is first pizza. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> no, Asher, you're, you got something right. You did it. S stop complimenting me. <laughs> I know I'm I... right. <laughs> I'll have uh, buffalo. Uh, Chicken, do you do that here? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the two of you leave the first pizza with your pizza. Did I get my two slices of pizza? Yeah, they gave you two for an exchange. Angrily gave you two slices in exchange for your original pizza slice. <laughs> the pizza Wait, exchange. as we're walking what? back, as we're walking back, I'm eating a slice of pizza, and I'm like, do you think they have the same deal and we can just constantly <laughs> multiply oh Pizza? I'm eat this first one. <laughs> you know, <laughs> we have, on. We've Let's made infinite no. pizza, Gillick. <laughs> right. <laughs> We've made infinite pizza. With infinite pizza comes infinite power. <laughs> Do you guys go into original pizza? Yes. yes. Okay. Gillick eats yeah. the first slice. You walk it you eat the first slice, you walk into original pizza with the second slice, and there's a guy at the door, he's like, Whoa, is that first pizza pizza? Yeah. yeah, why? Make a dexterity saving throw. Oh, <laughs> I get. I, I don't have a negative throw anymore. I'm Jeff Edo's kind this. of pizza place. Yep. I seven. They slap not. it. They slap it out of your hand and onto the ground. I, no, on my <laughs> infinite pizza. <laughs> they say, what? None of this trash in here. Only original would... pizza through these doors. I thought this was first pizza. No, that's first pizza. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is first. That's original pizza. No, this is original pizza. That's first pizza, and it's garbage. They gave us more oh, pizza. On the floor. <laughs> yeah, that's because it's trash. But if we They're get a piece of pizza away. here, we get two slices over there for free. So come buy more of this pizza, but you're just getting trash pizza over there. 
But I... <clears throat> All right. But you threw my food on the floor. I paid for that. Gillick summons the hammer. Give us, <laughs> give us two slices of pizza. Now! Oh, but you'll have to pay for them. Uh, all right. <laughs> he, he gives you two slices of pizza. Cool. Wait, why did I want these? <laughs> Gillick's just staring at his, his food on the floor. Here you go, bud. <laughs> what were we doing? Oh! Uh, and, like, I just see them still talking to Jack, Shock, I assume. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Like, yeah, I don't know what they're doing, John. Like, <laughs> buy one slice in one store and one slice in another store, and then keep going to the boat was the plan. Uh, they've gone I'm back doing, into the same in, store they already came out of, no? Yeah, they've been in that store twice now. I'm I'm like doing finger guns. Oh at, g- no! I'm doing finger guns at Gibetto right now. Oh D- no! Finger guns. Finger guns. And Gibetto sees the slap happen like in <laughs> slow motion. And he's so scared. Uh, It appears that uh, that Gillick is looking uh, pretty angry, no? Yeah, we got to get him. We got to get out of here. And Gibetto runs to Original Pizza to pull Gillick out by the shoulders. Gillick just kind of vacantly. (laughs) Come on, pal. Come on, pal. We're going to go. We're going to get out of here. We're going to go to the boat, buddy. Vacantly. Gibetto. Finger guns. Finger guns. I my pizza. What's up, dude? Finger guns. Okay, the- and he shoots finger guns. <laughs> no, the thing that you do with finger guns. You finger gun and then... Hey. Uh. <laughs> yeah, we, Jacques goes... Can we meet oh, up I, with the rest of the group? I like that. Yay. No. <laughs> <laughs> he picks up the ball of yarn and goes, Jacques, go fetch. Gebetto. <laughs> Jacques Asher. stares angrily. Asher. I mouth the word. Message. That was rude. Message. That was yeah. super. Jacques, I'm so sorry for. Yeah. Astro, he's not a dog. No. Yeah. You're right. He would be potentially the opposite of one if a yarn ball was around. Like what? a monster? <sighs> Wait. Did you just say the opposite of a dog is a monster? <laughs> I mean, yeah, because dogs are all that's pure and good. I look at Jacques. First reaction. He's just looking at you. Uh, he's shaking his head in disgust at you. More evidence. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, that, yeah. Is pretty, that is pretty cat <laughs> to be fair. <laughs> you, uh, you said that you have uh, the book, no? Yeah, it's, uh, well, yeah, yeah, one of us has it. I mean, Genevero we just, holds it out. we, there's a whole, uh, we, uh, uh, that line over there was a big fee. It was a fee line. <laughs> they, they charged you to stand in line? No, that's, no. That's right. That's dumb. why, see, that's the shit that First Pizza yeah. does. That's the problem with First Pizza. That's Jack, why that Original Pizza weird. is so oh, much yeah. better. Like, I no, know no, no. First... I, know they're, I know they're rough and tumble, <laughs> but I kind of like it. Uh, Jacques oh, reaches out and takes the book from Genevera, um, and he uh, grabs her hand and leans in and kisses the back of her hand as he takes the book. Um, oh, okay. And he, he says, oh, uh, thank you so much as, as for uh, this book. It... Uh, the, ca- the captain will be so happy to have the book. Uh, what, are you going to whisk people- her off her feet, her being Jenna Rivera? Whisk her? <laughs> whisk her off her feet? <laughs> oh, Actually, oh, I'm perhaps. I'm not 100% sure why it's so hard for you to believe that, like, I don't know, someone, like, that, I, I'm just, I don't. I, <laughs> Asher rages. <laughs> <laughs> take less damage. <laughs> um, the captain will be so happy to have this book. I'm certain that he will be willing to uh, take you across the sea to your uh, objective, even if your objective is uh, horribly dangerous and deadly, no? Yeah. Perfect. That's the plan. Let's go to him. Well, let's head on over to the captain. Let's, let's meet this do captain. Do it right now. Yeah. Okay. Uh, to the captain's end. Uh, follow me. And he uh, takes you guys uh, down the docks. Uh, he points Does up. Does Asher see like a tail flicking? Oh, like, yes. All the way? Oh, yes. <laughs> How do you not see that? Um, 
I, I try to like tap on Gebetto's shoulder and like I try to lean down like cast message on me Jacques turns back and he says uh, make sure you tail me closely I do not want you to lose me in the uh... <laughs> yeah we will tail yeah, you like that feline <laughs> I was in yeah I still can't believe first charge is line now that, that's so fucking gross cast message oh they're the worst message <laughs> Dude, I feel like we're getting to a hairball Asher, situation. What is your deal, Asher? Yeah, Asher, really? why are you being so I'm, rude? I feel, I'm feeling good about this. Okay. I'm just sad about my pizza. Cast message on me. Just do it. What? Just tell me. <laughs> That's the point, ding dong. No, like, use your words, dude. I will in my brain. Oh, my God. <laughs> Gebetto just points at him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm a magic user. I know when you're fucking lying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Now Gebetto cast message. Yeah. Uh, All right. Because you're raging, Asher, it just like screams back at Gebetto. You don't get to actually uh, hear anything in the message. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I. Oh, that's bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. It is. <laughs> it it's been it's been more than six seconds. All you hear, he'd be so tired if he was still. Yeah, raging. it's been it's been a long time. Uh, so, <laughs> um, in the message, I say, "Look at the fucking tail. There's a tail right there, and he has cat-like and features." Like snaps his head <laughs> yeah. behind us <laughs> to see who's tailing us. No, look at the tail. In uh, of- make a perception check. Uh that's actually a twenty. Five. <laughs> no, twenty six. Oh, someone's really fucking there. tailing us right now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, you get the sense that the guy who has stepped out of original pizza and is now glaring at Gillick, uh, you you feel like he's he might be you know he's still tracking you with his eyes, but he's not tailing you like physically. But no one else is tailing you. Okay. Um, <clears throat> tail on Jacques. One way. One way message. Or yeah. one, one, <laughs> one back and message, forth. Yeah, one message response. So that comes that comes out of my mouth. Whisper. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you see, uh, make a make a perception check, Asher. Uh, uh, twenty-four. You get the sense that he, by uh, a subtle movement of his body, he definitely heard you. And so, I'm if danger. he heard, <laughs> if Jacques, if Jacques heard, then I have to have heard also. Yeah, uh, you you did hear. And so, like, do I notice a tail? Make a perception check. I think you're probably a little incredulous at whatever Asher is. Right. <laughs> Typical. Oh. Uh, twenty-three. Yeah, you do. You do notice it. <clears throat> oh wow. Tell everyone. That's fun. D- <laughs> <laughs> huh. You know, I had never noticed it. I never would have noticed it. You know, it I just kind of got tunnel vision about being right. I don't even know if it mattered. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Huh. Okay. Uh, Gibetto, like makes a mental note. Jacques has a tail. <laughs> yeah so he leads you up to uh a large boat uh uh it's probably like it looks like it probably holds a crew of like 35 people um it's a beautiful wooden boat huge like three masts um and it is called so many masts. the ebony crown we have to get Ooh. on that we get we get to get on that I can't wait to meet the captain. The captain is, uh, uh, you will love the captain. He is, uh, when he is not angry, he is so much fun to be around. Are you, are you coming with us? Sounds like Asher. Yes, of course. I am, uh, I am part of the crew, no? I will spend time on the boat. You are part of the crew, yes. Yes? No. Yes. Yes. It'll be good to uh, get to spend some time with Keth as well, no? Yes. No? What? 
Ke- uh, Keth looks at Asher. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> he's mad because he thinks that Asher doesn't think he's a good time. Yeah, no, Keth's probably like probably the the goodest of times. Second, second best time in our group. <laughs> Yeah, Gil- uh, number, Gillick's clearly the first. <laughs> right, that's what I mean. I want what yeah. number am I? Yeah, Mike Ellison. What number is Genevera? <laughs> <laughs> let, let, let's Gibetto. pick bunks. Let's pick bunks, y'all. <laughs> Wait, I want to. Thanks, Kat. Uh, Wait, I want... <laughs> for some people, I'm the first, but like for most people, they're like. Ah! <laughs> I mean, let's just say this. Some people, I think. Everyone can agree Gillick is the most fun. Yeah. And now we wow. pick Bunks. And everyone <laughs> yeah, can agree that fun. Keth is the second most fun. And then everyone And else? then there's the rest yeah. of us. And that's okay. That's fair. I'll take that. I'll take that. <laughs> is that fair? I want I want a top bunk. I bet you do, buddy. <laughs> but you really struck me as a bottom bunk. <laughs> the way you've been handling Jock over there. Okay, great. <laughs> Keth just looks at him confused. He doesn't get it. Of course, uh, <laughs> definitely. We will see what the captain has to say. First, I have to uh, bring him this book, and then I will pitch to him uh, your residence on the boat and our new course of, wait, uh, wait, we of where we're headed. We're not. Wait. wait, I thought that it was just going to be a yes when we drop this book off. Oh, yeah. it will undoubtedly be a yes. No. Can we come yes. with you? Yes. No. What? This is what I was uh, talking about earlier. There was no guarantee. And no one was listening to me. He's, he said he's, con- he's a very Oh, my God. He kiss him he, already. He said he... <laughs> what? No, no. He's going to go talk to the captain. <laughs> and then and then we're going to be on the boat, Asher, right? right Asher yes, yes, yes. I will... I will take the book. I will surprise the captain with the book. He'll be so overjoyed. Uh, and I will uh, let him know that you are coming aboard and where we are going. And I'm, uh, I'm sure he will say yes. Wait, I thought you S- guys told simple us as that. that all we had to do is trade the book for passage. No, that's what exactly. they told you. And I point to Gillick <laughs> and Kath. I said the right. opposite of that. <laughs> he uh, said that all you had to do keep was keep the book, and, and you would not get better. Get a ride? <laughs> no, <laughs> what I meant. I didn't. Uh, Asher is just so. Flustered. That is uh, that's, uh, that is actually true. If you keep the book, you will not get a ride. That is, uh, he is not wrong. Oh, no, there was okay. no guarantee. He's he... so you were both right. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Look, uh, let's just. Let me go. Let's you just, just give yeah, you, you just uh, uh, sit here um, or stand. Uh, I will go and speak with the captain, and then um, I will come and get you. Great. Uh, and Gibetto is gonna like. He's gonna sit on the like edge of the dock with his feet hanging off uh, <coughs> above the water, you know, um, and just kind of take a moment to like appreciate the sea air and being in the docks and like wasting time not being afraid so yeah, sitting by the dock of the bed <laughs> uh, watching the time um, away. yeah 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 anthony when he gets up onto like the um onto the boat itself uh is he already going up or no yeah yeah he's heading up um i'd like to jump off the dock and and try and hit the boat and turn into a spider Turn into a fish instead. No, because I have to boat. get, I have to follow him on the boat. No, you can do it. You can do it like, like flounder and the little. I mermaid. turn into a you fly. Go, Fucking kinda... what? A, stupid. That's more simple. And you bob up, bob up through a little underwater porthole, and you look in the window. <laughs> no, I turn into a spider and I shoot web. <laughs> okay, way to yes and. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, my idea. <laughs> to be fair, we know but it. You did know but me <laughs> several times. Um. <laughs> uh, well, no butt, you know. Yeah, correct. Uh, Those so you have big butts. <laughs> you know, our lie characters no butted Asher, but our players yes and it wrong. Yes, because I I'm actually enjoying this. It's truly stupid, <laughs> but Asher's incredibly flustered. <laughs> so, uh, Rob, you uh, Asher turns into a spider. Yep. Uh, he zips over to the deck of the boat. Um, and I try and to then follow as you him. S- 
yeah, as you scutter up to the top of the uh, the railing, scuttle or uh, yeah. whatever. Scuttle? Yeah, I guess. Sc- scupper. Move, move. sure. Not scupper. As, as, you, move. as you reach scupper up, scupper is what's going to happen to the boat <laughs> yeah. when we get to the whirlpool. Uh, you get up to the top of the the railing, um, and Jacques is nowhere to be seen. Shit. Uh, um. I would. <laughs> but like... in spider, so you're like sure. <laughs> 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 um, I would like to use my eight eyes to search for him. Okay. Um, Investigate any traces of. Catman. Uh, so you uh, go ahead and make an investigation for me. Sure, seventeen. Okay. Uh, yeah, you hop down onto the boat. You look around. Uh, you you look into the main uh, uh, on the main main deck of the boat. You don't see him, so you move toward the the cabin on the back mm-hmm. um, that leads down into the uh, the back of the boat um, where the captain's quarters probably are. Um, you uh, scurry your way across the deck as quickly as you can. You almost get stepped on a couple times, but you're uh, uh, you're moving through. Uh, you shoot a web and zip over. It's a real ratatouille uh, situation. Yeah, yeah, uh, spider tui. Spider um, tui. <laughs> so banjo kazooie. <laughs> uh, you make your way into the back, and you see uh, what looks like. The captain's quarters. Uh, it's got a very ornate door on it, and it uh, it is at the head of the stairs that lead down into uh, the quarters below. I pump one of my spider legs in success. Like, yes! <clears throat> um, you hear boisterous laughter coming from inside the uh, cabin. Okay. I try and listen to what else I hear. Uh, you hear, you, as you start to focus, you hear Jacques say, uh, uh, yes, sir, I will, um, I will go and get them, no? Uh, and he throws open the door, uh, and starts. <laughs> I assumed I was on the door. <laughs> like... Yeah. <laughs> and Jacques goes running out of the, the back onto the deck. Oh, God uh, damn it. And he says, uh, <laughs> trying to catch up, catch up. <laughs> like Spider-Man style. Like, <laughs> Many pennies, uh, please uh, come in, see the captain. Okay. Hey, all right. And Gibetto hops up off the off the dock and like makes his way aboard with everybody else. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? How, are you uh, unwild shaping Asher? Or are you just like the? Minute, I, I assume the you've minute... now gotten onto Jacques' shoulder. <laughs> Have I? Yeah, yeah. You're th- like in that area. Oh no! If I'm on Jacques' shoulder, nothing. Do I need to make okay. a stealth check? No. Okay. Wait, the whole time you just wanted to be close to no, Jacques? No, I don't. That's what this was all about? No. <laughs> Asher was just jealous of Kath all along. Projecting. The the <laughs> four of you come on board and he says, oh, where is uh, the other one? Um, the Asher. I quickly, like, zip behind. Like, I try I <laughs> shoot a web at someone and I don't know. I'm sure I hit Gebetto in the face. And just like, ah! And then I just, like, appear on Wild Shape behind I here I am. I've been here it's the whole fine. time. We do not. Oh, you are here. Yeah. Great. Um, <laughs> uh, then, uh, I'm the smallest person. Per, then the five of us can go in, or the six of us can go and uh, speak with the captain. Then. Great. Oh, great. He's uh, letting us come on board. Uh, you'll have to um, negotiate with him, but he seemed very pleased about the uh, the book. So I I don't think it would be a problem. Excellent. Thanks okay. for the help. Uh, he walks over, he opens the door, and he says, Captain, uh, let me introduce to you the many pennies who uh, have helped to acquire this book for you. They are looking for passage uh, to the whirlpool. He says, well, I think we can work something out. After all, I am a reasonable fellow. And Horton I knew spins it! around yeah! in his captain's ship. Yeah! He knew it! <laughs> <laughs> and that's where oh we'll... Oh my God, Horton! 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 <laughs> Hey adventurers, DM Anthony here again. I just want to remind you that there are lots of ways to support the show. Head on over to patreon.com slash adventure inc. Tell your friends about the show. 
rate and review us on iTunes or wherever you get your podcasts. Links and more can be found at adventureinc.podbean.com. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next week.